As part of our continuous efforts to educate our users about how to make the best of their efforts, we choose top five mistakes done by our users. Mistake number one, air bubbles and the sample tube. These are the air bubbles we are referring to. The air bubbles can be caused by either elongating the silicon sample tube, which is about two meters, or the silicon sample tube is not well immersed in your tank. Mistake number two, not shaking the reagent in its initial bottle. Reagents should be shaken very well before emptying them in the refoot glass vial, especially those which are highly viscous. Mistake number three, reagent level is not enough in the glass vial. For example, the level of the reagent here is not enough. We have to refill it to the top. Once you refill the reagent, you have to reset it from the up. Mistake number four, not placing the magnetic stirrer in the testing or RO chamber. Mistake number five, RO rinsing chamber, not filling enough RO water. The optimum volume in the RO chamber is eight mil. Any volume between seven and nine mil is acceptable for the syringe to rinse properly. Insufficient RO water is caused by improper calibration of the rinsing chamber. RO water is not enough in your tank. RO tube is not well immersed in your tank. 